Hi everyone, this is Sam and welcome to the second episode of Coffee Break. Now, during our first episode, we talked about how to begin again. Mm-hmm. And there's a whole lot of areas that we touch on. Yeah. Right? Yeah. But now, we are going to talk about the proposed four-day work week. But before we dive into that, I'd like to ask you, did you enjoy your long weekend? Oh, no, man. Diba? Oh, at the start of the year nga, tinitingnan na natin, sorry, ako na lang. Hindi <laughs> ko na kayo nadamay. Tinitingnan, <laughs> tinitingnan ko na kung alin yung ma- may mga long weekend para napaplano ko na. So, enjoy na, enjoy ko yun. Oh, diba? Ikaw naman eh. Parang hindi ko maalala yung last time na nag <laughs> weekend ako. Wala <laughs> Hindi mo na-enjoy? Kasi, ah, nagtrabaho ka? Oo, oh, puro okay. kasi trabaho eh. Mm-hmm. So, it would be nice, you know, to wow. actually want to enjoy it. But, but at like, least, diba, the long weekend gave you the chance to work also still. Sort of. Okay. Sort of. Yeah. Yeah. Ako as an employee, there are times <laughs> na I enjoy my long weekend kasi I get to plan something. Mm-hmm. Lalo na if the budget permits, yeah. I get to plan something really nice. But short trip. Of course, it's it doesn't happen all the time. Hindi eh, naman palagi kang may budget for long weekend trips, mm-hmm. diba? Pero nakakatulong siya. Eh, ako talaga, mahilig akong maglakwat siya. Mahilig mm-hmm. ako mag road trip. So, gustong gusto ko yung long weekends kasi inaalam ko kung saan may mga buffet, <laughs> Bagong resto, gusto ko matikman. Uh-oh. Lahat ng napapanood ko sa YouTube, pinupuntahan ko yan. Gusto ko matikman. Uh-huh. So, Kapag may long weekend kasi, yung kids wala ding pasok. Uh-huh. Yeah. So, you, we, we get to time. plan you know, a family trip together. Mm-hmm. So, okay mm-hmm. din. Yes. Yung ganon. Well, I'm sure you've heard, kasi kumalat din sa internet yan eh, yung tungkol sa four-day work week. Mm. I think isa yan sa mga pre-nopose nung bagong upo si uh, Presidente. No? Na magkaroon tayo ng 4-day work week pero 12 hours daw. Mm-mm. Compressed work siya kung okay. maga. O kasi alam ko sa labor code, parang may requirement tayong 40 to 48 mm-hmm. hours, di ba? Na mm-hmm. kailangan ma-complete natin within mm-hmm. the work week. Right. Right. Oh, oh, but that is for regular employees. Hindi lang ako sure sa details pag contractual ka. Uh-huh. Like pag per day ang bayad sa yung. Kasi tayo parang we get salary on a monthly basis. Mm-hmm. That's correct. Diba? So, eto na nakita niyo mga post online yung sa Microsoft, de ba mm-hmm. na parang they're proposing a four day work week sa Pilipinas kaya sa tingin niyo, okay kaya sa tingin. Kasi parang ako may dalawang points I think eh, kung bakit mm-hmm. sa pino propose. First mm-hmm. is to um, alleviate the the heavy traffic situation mm-hmm. that we have every day. Pangalawa, para mas may re-energize at mas may increase in productivity ng work-life balance. Yes, oh. basically. Oh. Nice. Actually, so, nakaka-reduce talaga siya ng stress. Kasi syempre, mm-hmm. mababawasan yung araw na papasok ka sa work. You oh, get more time correct. to relax or, you know, just to have a quiet time for yourself. Diba? Parang just, you know, to be away from all the chaos of your ng workplace, workplace mo, mo. Right. so nakaka-reduce mm. talaga siya ng stress at the Ma- same time it also helps us with our expenses yes. if you choose to just be at home mm-hmm. diba? bahay ka lang wala kang okay. gasos walang pamasahe no need to buy lunch mm-hmm. outside yeah. so, bahay ka lang talaga pero mas mahaba naman yung oras diba? 12 hours right. but most of us work kasi more than 8 Sabagay. hours eh. diba? parang ganun din nakocover eh. din siya actually mm-hmm. yun na lang on the road mo eh. covered na covered mo na siya <laughs> Actually, for parang some countries... 16 hours, kanya nag-grabrabaw. <laughs> <laughs> in, okay. in, in some countries talaga, they really practice that. Oh, oh. Uh, natuwa ako, nung, when I was there in, mm-hmm. in the UK, nalaman ko na marami silang, t- parang tatlong araw ang off nila. Mm-hmm. And marami silang time talaga, considering pa na um, yung lugar, marami silang parks. Correct. So, people are not just contained inside the mall. Mm-mm. Marami silang parks. Talagang, uh, the government makes sure the, uh, na talagang may work-life balance yung mga tao nila. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yung four-day work week, alam ko talagang ini-implement na siya abroad eh. Sa yeah. ibang countries. Siguro depende rin sa, sa nature. bansa. Oo, sa nature. And the nature of the work. Kasi dito, pag tumabay tayo sa park, mag-aamoy araw tayo. Yun nga eh. <laughs> Diba? Yun yeah. lang. Yun lang mahirap. Yun lang, parang may enjoy mo nga yung break time mo, pero with matching pollution and init. Oh, wala talaga tayong ibang choice kundi pumunta ng, ano, ng malls. Unless diba? otherwise, magdadrive ka palabas. Di, saka yung culture kasi abroad, mas laid back compared mm. to us. But ito, ano siya ha, parang depende sa lugar. Uh-oh. Like sa UK, di ba napuntahan mm. mo, ang aga, nag, ang aga nagsasara ng mall. Oh yeah, hanggang 5pm. Isipin mo kung nagtatrabaho ka sa mall, hanggang 5pm ka lang. <laughs> But here in the Philippines, our mall is up to 10. 
And Pirates I know abroad, because when I visited like sa Canada, when they have night shopping, mm-hmm. hanggang 8 p.m. night shopping na yun na. Mm-hmm. Isa kanila big deal na yun. Right. Extended na yung night shopping na hanggang 8. Tapos uh, sa atin naman sa nina sa nina tayong hanggang 10. Pag nag-extended shopping like for the holidays, hanggang mm-hmm. 12. Isipin mo people who work in the malls will have to work until 12 midnight. To accommodate the holiday promos na mga right. malls mm-hmm. all over right. the Philippines, de ba? So ibang klase yung ano eh yung culture kasi sa atin plus the weather plus the working condition. There's so many things, things that we consider. should consider. Pero sa tingin ko talaga guys, ang four day work week should really depend on what type of business the mm. company is in and, and what type of work you do. Yes, right. ba? Meron siyang advantages, madami. Marami siyang maitutulong sa atin. Meron din siyang drawbacks. Kasi like, kung yung business mo is more into, parang you deal with a lot of customers, how will it impact your company if you, you don't have any person to man the store or your business on a Friday? Correct. Yeah. Na Monday to Thursday lang, eh, ang dami mong inaasikaso mga customers, di ba? Hanggang pag Friday, wala na. So it will highly affect your business, eh. Yeah. Growth in business. So feeling ko talagang depende siya sa industriya. Kung oh. pwede o oh, hindi. It's mm-hmm. something na you know the management will have to look into. Right. If kaya mo survive ng business yung ganong klasing ano work week. But on the downside, because if we're not inclusive, also, sure, hindi may encourage sa mga tao to work in operations. Because mm-hmm. sure, kung ako, ako pala, di mag office na ako. Di ba yeah. kung gusto ko ng three days na off. Why would I, you know, go, go office na lang. Yeah, why would I go there? <laughs> pero, pero de, unless it's your passion, of course. Like uh-huh. us, because parang like we don't have an option to to work for four uh-huh. days, de ba? For the media, kasi tayo wala tayong holiday, eh. oh. de ba? Kung kailan yung holiday, may uh-huh. tama. Dapat yung tayo yung trabaho. So tayo oh. actually, kami mga taga media, may jo bias ng konti. Sana inaka kami mm. magtrabaho ng holidays, kasi <laughs> right, Christmas, right. New Year, whatever occasion there is, kahit. Ah, uh, National Heroes Day, we're still on board. Yeah, yes, diba? yes, Christmas Day, New oh, Year's Christmas Day, New Year, na kaprograma tayo. So pa, yeah, sa nai na tayo sa ganyan. Sa nai na talaga tayo sa ganyan. Uh-oh. Pero ikaw, as a person, would you love to have ano uh, a four day work week lang? For those in the office, I think it would be a great help. I really mm-hmm. think so. Um, especially when it comes to their budget, ganyan. Kasi ap- since apat na araw lang mm-hmm. din yun, mas kaya mo siyang mas stretch out. Oh, mas stretch mm-hmm. out eh. So, sobrang... Baon ka na lang kasi nga medyo mas matagal. Alam mo, iniisip ko, kunyari, banks, ipapractice nila yung four days lang silang open. <laughs> eh, ibang banks nga ngayon, hanggang weekends oh, open na. Weekend, diba? Pero may mga gumagawa ng ganyan dito, di ba? Yung mga call centers. Mm-hmm. Nakakompressed work, uh, work schedules na sila, work hours, tapos four days lang in a week. May mga gumagawa na rin talaga ng ganyan. Sa Depende atin. lang talaga sa... Industriya mo. Oo. Type of business you're in. Mm. Pero, it can, yeah, it can help with the traffic. Mm-hmm. Malamang, mababawasan. So, Tsaka, mas... Sabi nila kasi may study daw na ginawa abroad na mas happier daw. Yung mga tao. Oo, mas happier daw yung mga tao. I think so. Nakita ko yun dun. <laughs> uh, <laughs> mas, mas laid back sila eh. Mas relaxed oh, oh. eh. Kasi tayo dito sa Philippines, parang yung culture natin laging on the go eh. Yes. Rush. Kumbaga. Yeah, we are like, uh, kung i-compare ko lang ano, parang ang Pilipinas parang, hindi naman at par talaga na parehong pareho. But what I'm trying to say is, yung pagiging buhay <laughs> ng Pilipinas ay parang New York. New York. Kasi sabi ko New York, parang kala mo naman, swell doon New York. Hindi naman tayo, hindi naman New Yorker yung swell doon natin at the weather and the forma. Pero what I'm yeah. trying to say is, di ba sabi nila, the city that never sleeps. Yes. Yeah. So ang Pilipinas parang ganun din. Malila. Di ba? Hindi na nga yeah. tayo nakontento sa banking na hanggang weekend. Eh. Meron na tayong Extended mobile na. banking. Yeah. Yeah. Pwede ka pang mag-banking beyond your yung right. typical working hours. So, talagang it really depends on the industry you're in. Tsaka dati yung mga banko hanggang alas stress lang ng hapon. Ngayon hanggang 7 na rin sila. Yung iba, mm-hmm. di ba? Alam mo ako, talagang feeling ko, masarap din yung days na na-enjoy natin yung long weekend. Pero mm-hmm. kung tatanungin mo ako sa 4-day work week, parang hindi ko siya masyado bet on a regular basis. Ah. Okay. Siguro parang meron lang sigurong season na pwedeng, oh, parang ano, ano ba pag, tawag doon yung pag nagbabago yung oras sa abroad? Daylight saving oh, daylight time. time. Oh, parang ganon. Oh, oh. Di ba dati pinalaw natin yan na iba yung oras ng pasok sa school na alala nyo? Nung grabe yung brown out oh, oh. Oh, or black out. So, yeah. So, feeling ko parang meron lang sigurong season na pwede natin gawin yon, but not on a regular basis. And kasi this is coming from, yes, why? Coming from why? me. Kasi sa totoo lang, bilang 
uh, Filipina mom, minsan mas magastos pag nasa bahay. Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> diba? Lalo na nauso na yung delivery ng pagkakaroon. Ay, yung mga anak mo nasa bahay. O, oh, tara, movie watching tayo. Bukas ang yeah. airport. Siyempre, may junk food. Kuryente. Mami, oh. pa-deliver ka naman pizza. O, oh. oh, di-deliver ka na naman. Ay, ah, true. <laughs> mas true kaya, di ba? I hear, I hear our boss say that minsan. Sa bahay. Hi, boss Ed. Then <laughs> <laughs> sabi niya, eh, pasok na lang ako. Mas magasas sa bahay. Pero hindi, so, naranasan ko din yun eh. As a mom, mas magasas kasi minsan iniisip ko, okay, nag-enjoy nga kami, nag-bonding kami. Pero since na-disrupt yung daily routine nyo na pumapasok sila sa school, mm. nasa work ka, parang alam mo na eh, may routine na, may baon na sila. Divided na yung budget, may pang pamasahe ka, may pang lunch ka for that day. Pag nasa bahay ka, walang control masyado. That's true. Diba? Totoo yan. Diba? Tsaka ikaw din mismo, tatama rin ka magluto. Magpapadeliver ka na lang. Maka naisip ko din, diba? Like after the long weekend, for example, parang may hangover ka eh. Diba? Kasi matagal medyo nakakatamad pumasok. Imbes na parang ready na ako yung Monday na ulit. Parang kung isipin mo kung Tuesday ka na ulit papasok, parang mas nakaka... Tamad na siya. Totoo, may hangover ka ng bakasyon. Nasanay na eh. Nasanay yung katawan mo, tatlong araw ka nakapahinga. Then saka, ano, after vacation, kunyari, nag-long weekend ka, tapos sunod-sunod yung long weekend, tapos lahat yun, nag-plan ka ng something, nag-bakasyon ka. Ang gastos, ha? Mm-mm. Ang gastos. Ako, if you're gonna ask me, happy na ako sa five days a week na trabaho. Paminsan-minsan, long weekend. Pero okay na ako sa five days. Oo. Kasi yung oras mo naman sa work, it's just, ano eh, for me lang ah, sa culture natin, kailangan lang talaga natin magandang time management sa right. bawat. Kung baga, you have to practice it on your own para at least you can get off work on time. Discipline. Diba? Oh. Alam mo yun? Something that millennials, <laughs> something that millennials should never agree on. <laughs> Kasi mga impatient nga daw ba? Kaming mga wanting a better life. <laughs> so ikaw, ano, si Chloe, okay na siya sa five, five days. days I'm good with it. If it's, if the work is output based, Um, four days, I would go for it. If okay. it's output based, pero kung service sa kung um, operations, definitely hindi din talaga. Mm. So, so ano ka? Ano ka rin for. kung maghati ka din? It depends on the history. Para feeling ko yung 12, yeah. 12 hours na nagtatrabaho ka, it's so draining. Feeling ko lang. Yeah, yeah medyo draining na yon. Kasi mm. ano kung di na lang ito tulog mo eh? So, Isipin mo mas mahaba yung gising ka kaysa sa tulog ka. So, mas mahaba yung time na hindi mo kasama makikita yung mga yeah. anak mo. Pag alis mo, tulog sila. Pag balik mo, tulog pa exactly. sila. Na-experience ko kaya yun. But, but something that we didn't talk about pala, just konti lang, no? yung work from home. Kasi uh-huh. it could also happen, eh. Totoo, totoo. Ah, wala silang oras doon, I think. Wala sila Kasi they work. I used to work from home. May, may way Sa- para ma-monitor siya eh. Oh. Uh, there is a way to work from home. May way para ma-monitor. Tsaka mag-a-adjust ka siguro sa time zone ng kausap. Ayun lang. Mostly mm. mga foreigner yung yes. mga ano mo doon, diba? Maybe far-fetched pa siya dito uh-huh. sa Philippines. Uh-huh. Tsaka it yeah. depends yeah. on anong klaseng work from home yung gagawin mo. Mm. Diba? Yung sa case mo ba, we'll just touch it for a little. Yes, ano? yes. Yung sa case mo ba, nagustuhan mo siya? No una. <laughs> Pero sobrang draining siya kasi yung kama mo nandiyan eh. So the distractions are all over. Uh, so the bed is calling you to look at what's productive. <laughs> But for yeah. other people maybe for those who are always stressed out by the mm-hmm. MRT, the balance ng struggle mo every day sa community. Depende talaga. Commute. They'd probably yeah. appreciate that. They Kung anong yeah. classing work from home kasi ako naman during the maternity leave, of mm. course hindi ko pwedeng pabayaan yung program. Right. I have to produce for my show and mm-hmm. I actually enjoyed it kahit na medyo mahirap kasi puyat ng alaga ng bata. But, mm-hmm. you know, it gives me that feeling na, you know, aside from being a mom, yes, you're still DJ Sam. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. nakakapag-record ako sa bahay, di ba? Mm-hmm. For, for the show, to keep it up, para hindi naman ako mawala ng matagal during the maternity leave, which is, and na-enjoy ko din. Mm-hmm. Di ba? Kung baga parang, it's it gives... Productive ka pa rin. Oo. Oh, oh. Tsaka ano eh, it keeps me sane. Oo. Oh, oh. Di ba? Yeah. Hindi ka nababaliw sa pagiging nanay. Yeah. <laughs> Alam mo yun? Yeah. Parang there's this other... Part persona of you, of you. Na you get to enjoy doing your passion. Right. That's correct. Yeah. So that's it. We are already at the end yep. of our discussion. Mm-hmm. And uh, you know, we wish we can extend. Pero baka maumay na kayo. Parang miss nyo naman kami. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ayan. And feel free to drop your comments in the comment section. And we do hope that, you know, may natutunan kayo from mm-hmm. us. Ayan. And do not forget to follow so, us on social media. Alam niyo yan, meron kaming fan page that's facebook.com slash Easy Rock Manila or just simply search for 96.3 Easy Rock. And yung website natin. Yeah, easyrock.com.ph. Okay. Feel free to visit our page. And uh, our kanila, diba? mobile app, of course, yeah. is yeah. now up and running. So do download that. It's for free at the Google Play Store and iOS users. And of course, Chloe was mentioning a while ago na 
We are mm-hmm. inviting you guys to, you know, um, send us topics na gusto nyong pag-usapan mm-hmm. namin. Yeah. yeah. Diba? Baka may mga nice. topics sa yung gusto namin, uh, gusto nyong matouch namin and mm-hmm. discuss about it. We can do that for you guys. Just be sure that you message us sa uh, fan page namin sa Easy Rock or, on Facebook. Or right? maybe you can comment down below. Alright. So, and do not forget to click the subscribe button. Ayan. Para tumagal naman yung coffee break. <laughs> Pati yung, notif- right. pati yung notification bell. Ayan. Yeah. Para yung get notified. Yeah. You know, you know, get notified when we have a new video. Feeling vlogger. <laughs> this is something new. Alright, so thank yeah. you so much for watching. Once again, my name is Sam. And of course, my name is Chloe. And I'm Nick. And this is Coffee Break. Bye! Bye! Bye.